What is up, ladies and gentlemen? My name's Loverfella, and welcome back to Conan. I need to say this right away before like half you click out. I was looking at my analytics today. I'm sitting at work, I'm looking at my analytics, and I notice literally like 30 to 40% of people click out of my videos in like the first 10 seconds. Like literally right when it starts, people click out. I don't know if that's because people hate my intro, so I'm wondering if I should try to change my intro and see if that helps, or if it's because I have ads at the beginning of the video. I have no idea what it is, but I'm not starting this one off like I normally do because I want to see if there's actually a difference if people are like, dude, your intro is weird. Whoa, look at that little creeper coming down here. Um, So that's kind of weird and something that I noticed that I wanted to mention. All right, so we're playing Conan. What I've learned so far about Conan is that it's an extremely brutal game. It makes Ark no. look easy. Oh, I got him. I got him. Oh, it was one hit. I got him. <laughs> Back. So it's an extremely difficult game. I mean, you die like crazy when you first start out, but it's really fun. And I'm playing right now with Die Hard. He's played way more than me. He's helped me learn the ropes, try to figure out how to play the game. Because right now there's this really weird feature where every single time this game updates on unofficial or official servers, it rolls back six hours, a six hour rollback almost daily. And so Die Hard has been going through and manually saving it. That way we don't have to worry about losing things. But it is one of the reasons why I haven't been playing this game a whole lot right off the bat. Because I'm like, I'm not going to play this game if I have to restart my episode every day. So I am a new character. I made him look the same, but I did lose my base I made last time because the server rolled back however many hours and I just lost everything. And so Die Hard and I are going to go try to whip up a base. We're going to have to do manual saves until this uh, feature or whatever they want to call it gets fixed. Oh man, I'm starving. Uh oh, I need to eat. Um... What, what do I have here? Feral flesh. That probably doesn't seem like a good thing to eat. A little savory flesh, though. I could eat that. that. Seems tasty. Is it hurting me any? Look at that. It doesn't hurt me when you eat it, and it's raw, so that's really nice. Food's up. Water seems to be going down really fast in this game. Oh, food poisoning. Okay, I have seven food poisoning, so maybe that is going to hurt me significantly. That's probably not a good thing. All right, Um, I have a level up here, and I guess I'm going to go for a lot of strength on this guy. Two levels up. A lot of strength. I want to be able to just totally mow people down, smash with my axe. You know the deal. Actually, let's get the stone sword. Let's see. I see. I was thinking originally I want to be like an archer, but now I'm thinking it could be cool to be like a guy with like a weapon and get up in there. If I get a lot of damage, a lot of health, that could be cool. Can I make this? I need 10 twine to make twine. All right, we'll make 26 twine. That's a pretty good number. Anyway, guys, hope you're having an awesome day. Channel is going great right now. If you guys are wondering, we're at 20, almost 26,000 subs, and I feel fantastic about it. Ooh. And what the? Oh, welcome back. Man, you know this map pretty well. That's not a good thing considering how many times I've died. Oh, I have, I have food poisoning and it's killing me. What do I do? Um, don't eat uh, raw food. I ate a bunch of it. What do I do? Um, make a bed. Uh, Use this twine. I'm gonna drop you. Oh, hurry. I don't have any hurry. twine. Oh, no. Um, craft some twine out of five. Um, I actually am not even high enough level for a bed. It's not looking good. I'm going down. <laughs> Just, um, add a point in your vitality. Oh, just back up. Peace out. Oh. Alright, I just died from food poisoning. I thought that it seemed too good to be true that you could just get out there and just straight up eat whatever you want. So, um... Die Hard's gonna make a bed. I'm gonna try to run back. I know there are, like, two giant statues, and I was, like, slightly right of those statues, so... Hopefully, if I just go this way and take a sharp right, we'll find it. But I really don't know. I have no idea. It could be... I mean, honestly, I'm not sure if the spawns are random or if the spawns are the same spot all the time. Got some angry people over there. Okay, so I think we were this way. Looking at the map, I have like a brief understanding of where we were, but there's like a creepy looking gorilla monster right there, and I'm trying not to get near that guy. And also, if you guys are like wanting to join, I know that it's kind of weird to join the server because there's no link I can just give you. I can't just say, hey guys, here's my link from Nitrado. You can click it and join it from here. It's not like that. Right now, oh, there's some people. There's a giant. Okay, all right. This is this is a little bit sketchy here. So to join it, all you have to do, go into the server, um, go into unofficial servers, type in Loverfella, join the one that says Loverfella's Conan server, that's what it's called, and then uh, the password's love, so don't don't join a fake one. Um, there is a couple of them that are using my name out there. Not real, not me, totally fake, but that's kind of how you join it right now. Just go ahead and search it, and uh, it should show up. You might have to check like a box for showing password ones or something, but... That is the that is the gist of it. So I see the giant statues over there. I know we ran towards those giant statues. So I think once I get back on this land, I'll be able to rejoin Die Hard right now. Um, a lot of games like this, like the survival games, are so hard when you first start out. Like it is brutal because you just don't know how to do anything, and they don't hold your hand through it. There's no tutorial. It doesn't explain what things do, which is good, but it's also very difficult. You just get in the game, you have no idea what's going on, and you just hope you're you just hope you're doing it kind of right. Yeah, there's that guy's base right there. That is where I met the dude. Look, there's the guy. He's standing on top of his base like a savage guy. Look at that. That's weird. 
Pretty cool looking base though he's got. All right, alligator just came at us. That was kind of scary. So while we're running there, I just want to talk about something. Um, in a lot of my videos, especially on my one year anniversary video, I got a bunch of comments like, dude, I, I love how positive you are. You're the only YouTuber that's so positive. I love that you do that all the time. And uh, it's really cool that you guys think that I'm always positive, but I do just want to share something today. Hyena killed him. Oh man. Well, I made it back to the statue, so that's good. And I know we were just right across the way over there. Um, so as long as those giant alligators don't eat us, we should be okay. Maybe a little bit. Just made it back to our bodies. I just like walked through and saw two big dead people fall down. So maybe I'll be able to, oh, what just happened? There it is. Maybe I'll be able to get some items back here. I'm not sure. Does it, yeah, it does keep items on death. This looks like it would be mine because I have a bunch of random junk. You know what? Maybe it's not. It has some bones on it. Oh, that's definitely not mine. Oh man. Oh man. There's a hyena after me. He's going to destroy me. This is the same one that just killed Die Hard, I think. The hyena has a lot of health, man. You'd think smash him in the head 10 times with a pickaxe would kill it. It's not even bleeding. What? All right, anyway, like I was saying, story about today. So I'm at work today, minding my own business, trying to do what interns do, which is just survive, try to basically not destroy anything. I'm just kidding. Like you just try to do the best you can, but you really don't know a lot of the inner workings of the company you're at. A lot of times you just have no idea what you're expected to do because you just, you're an intern. You don't understand how it works. So I'm at work today, um, worked on this project for the last two weeks, thought it was absolutely incredible, put all my heart and soul into this project, eight, nine hours a day working on this sucker, looks so good, go to present it today to the management team and I literally just got destroyed. I'm talking absolutely obliterated, probably one of the top five worst experiences of my entire life. Like these people did not like my project, did not like my idea and they were, they were not afraid to hold back from it. Like they just absolutely destroyed it. And in that moment, man, I felt so bad. I was like, this, is, I mean, it honestly was probably one of the worst feelings ever. Like just putting so much effort into something and getting destroyed, like just mutilated. Like they took me, they chewed me up and just spit out my bones, but they weren't even bones anymore because they destroyed it so much. Let's see. Let's see here. There's a flag up there. Giant statues there. So I should be right across on that little island area over there. But anyway, um, those are the moments right there. Those moments where you just feel so dis like just you feel terrible that you can come back up and rebound into something much better. So, um, in YouTube or in, in work or whatever it is, like when you have like a terrible moment, like, man, this is really freezing a lot. Maybe my computer is like just sucking right now. Um, but like you have a moment where you just absolutely hit the bottom. You're just like, Oh my gosh, this is the worst thing ever. It's a lot easier to come back up after that. Cause like, I mean, the truth is you can't do much worse, right? So you can only get better. It's just kind of inspiring to think like maybe, maybe it was pretty embarrassing and sucked at the time, but in like a year, in a couple of months, it's going to be a lot better. I don't know. That's something that I tell myself all the time. I'm like, yeah, that sucked, but I don't mind it a whole lot because sucking is like how you learn. Like if you don't suck at something, then you're not doing it right. You're not learning right. Oh my gosh. What the heck? You made a giant club. All right, finally back here to our pile of dead bodies. Uh, this one might have something. Nope, not that one. I'm thinking this one's actually me. There it is. Take all that good stuff right there. Finally back with Die Hard. Uh, finally on the road towards hopefully not Here's dying. A for you. All right, we're setting this bed as our new checkpoint or respawn point, whatever you want to call it. I am going to put on some clothing here. Where does this go? This is this is head, torso, You're hands. All right, push them forward. This is intense. I really like yeah, this a lot us. right We're now. We're gonna have to be real careful. All right, another spider too. Spider's gonna be killed on sight. Okay. Oh, you can. Looks like he's holding down. Maybe is that left click for charged up? Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My guy was just They're dancing with it. With these That's why you gotta charge him up and hold. hold oh. Yeah, there you go. Just go like that. All right. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. We can just walk around with this charged up. Oh, there's one. Nope. I missed. I missed. Oh no, it's, it's destroying me. Oh, actually, that go. didn't really hurt me at all. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Careful. Careful, another one. Oh man, and there's a bird right next to it, and apparently the birds can be really aggressive and hard to kill. Oh, there's a nice clean hit right there. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh, right, this is so fun. This little crevice up here. Okay. This game's a lot more fun with friends. I'm just gonna say that right now. Just killed a bunny because I'm brutal like that. I felt pretty good. There's an encampment over here. We're just going to run through it. What does this guy have the map up. memorized? He just knows there's an encampment up here. Twice. What is this? What is this do rock do right do. here? What is that? Coal. Oh, here's a rhino. Better oh, my. That. That's probably not a good thing to hit. Oh, one second. Stamina. Stamina's out. One second. Got to yeah. recharge it. By the way, those those black rocks right there, these whole blocks. They what? They're really good for... Uh, they're cold blocks. These red ones. No, the black ones. Oh, the charcoal? Them really handy in the future awesome i'm ready 
Right. Do you see where I'm looking at? That's yes. The oh yeah, yeah. We're, the crevice. Walk here. Yeah. All right. Let's take out this hyena. <laughs> we can just charge him up, smack it down. Look at that. That's like one hit. That's, That's pretty it. cool. Easy. The hang of it. All right. Moving up. We are moving up. Now these are. What Hopefully we don't lose awesome, everything. Like, the is, uh, server. There was basically no camps with any spawns, barely any, anyways. Oh, okay. Spider! Oh my gosh, this is why this is a fun game. Like this is very enjoyable to do. I don't know if I really need the spider web. Okay, one second. I am carrying too much to move, so I'm just gonna. Oh no! Oh, I can't move! Oh my gosh, those like completely paralyze you. What? Crippling poison? It just stacks. I got you. Dang, I can't even move when that poisons me. Yeah, Still can't. poison. If we both get crippled, we done. Man, okay, spiders are really strong. I see why he said we need to take them out instantly. I still can't move. Oh, you know what? That might be because I still weigh too much, actually. I think that's the real reason here. 99% weight. All right, I'm ready. I just can't pick anything up. So there's an encampment up here, he says. Um, Looks like there's a pretty big encampment, honestly. Whoa. Oh my gosh, look how many people are up here. What? 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 Oh no. Oh no. I'm not going to make it. Oh, there's so many. I can't run quick enough. They're all after him, though. They're all after him. Oh my gosh. Dude, what the heck is going on right now? I need to drop some more stuff. I don't, I don't know. Drop the web, I guess. My stamina is at like nothing. Oh man. What the crap? They just come out and swarm you? Okay. So... Uh, looks like they're still chasing him, but I can't really tell. Oh, there he is. He's on that rock over there. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You gotta run quicker. I'm here. Let's go. Let's go. Where are we going? Okay, let's run. Oh, man. It's frozen. Don't freeze right now. Oh, that was a pretty big freeze, honestly. Wow. All right. All right. Still freezing. Yep. All right. We just almost there. Oh, my gosh. Other spider. Oh, no. I gotta kill it. Oh, I gotta kill it. Oh, and there's so many people here. Oh, no, and there's an emu. Oh, this is not looking good. I don't think I'm going to make it out of this one. I'm dead. I'm dead. Going down. Oh, man, that was brutal. That was okay, though. I have a bed. Hopefully, I can respawn at the bed and run back here. He might die, too, though. We got spider. We got emo. We got freaking people with saws on their rocks. But I know exactly where I was, so I should be able to get back there pretty quick. This is really fun, so if you guys haven't got this game yet, I would recommend it. Like, it's not that much. I think it was like 30 bucks or something. I don't know. I'm really enjoying it. And I think, I mean, I, I usually I, I'm done recording at this point, but like, I'm actually so into this right now. I might make this a little bit of a longer video for you. Gotta hide from the spider. Nope, spider found me. Nope, 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 nope. Spider's super quick, too. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it back. It looks like he, oh man, look at that. They just shoot out little freaking spider balls or something like that i don't know spiders really fast turns out also okay good to know maybe he can't follow me up here though since there's rocks in the way let's hope almost back okay there's a rhino up here there was a couple couple crazy bandits up top apparently he was warning me about the bandits when we first started but i thought he was saying that there were no bandits because the game glitched there's a couple guard in the front entrance hmm hmm do I have enough stamina to make it through this gate with all these people that want to kill me? That's the real question here. Hmm. Well, there's only one way to find out. Let me let that recharge real quick. I moved my camera to the other side. That way you guys can see my stats on the right. We're just going to go for it. Go, 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 go. Oh. oh, I hear Bo shooting. I don't see many people up here, though. They must all still be down there fighting him or something. Anything I can take? What is this? Stone. Okay, I guess I, I don't know. I feel like it... Oh, 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 oh. Nice. Dude, you're, how are you live? What? How did he survive that? What the crap? To, left, to, your left. to my left. Oh, that looks like my body over there. Okay. Did he just kill like 10 bandits? Up here. Ostrich and all that stuff. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, he made a little spot. Oh my goodness. Spider. Punch him down. Oh, did you lose your... Did you die too? Oh, man. I can't hit him. There it is. He's dead. He's dead. Alright, my dead body's over here. 
Hopefully I can get my stuff back. Maybe he died too, but he had an extra bed or something. Yeah, no, he definitely died right here, dude. But don't even act like you didn't. I was like, there's no way he survived that. Okay, okay. So this must be me. Yes. There we go, boys. There we go. And my giant bludgeon guy. Okay. All right. Let's and I weigh too much. All right. Maybe the coal weighs a ton. 1.04. Put my pants back on. Maybe my feet back on. Legs. I'm going to drop. I don't know. Maybe I'll drop the bone. I don't need. That's a lot of weight. Okay. Where'd he go? All right. Still moving in. Deeper now. I see another camp up ahead. Rhinos. Like, this is a pretty freaking big map, dude. This is a really big map. All right, guys, finally found my base, so I'm going to go back, drop some stuff off inside. What the? Oh, there's a dead elk right here, or whatever this is. Is there anything in it? Bone, stone, hide, savory flesh. Ooh, that's, that's some good flesh right there. I don't care who you are. You'll like some savory flesh. How am I caring too much? I just dropped 100 rocks. Do these rocks not weigh that much or something? All right, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'm going to go drop some stuff off inside and then just go enjoy the rest of my night, guys. I hope you do the same. I love you, and I'll see you all in the next one.